Aesgarth Falls is situated on the River Yore. The Aesgarth Falls waterfalls have made up of three falls, the upper, the middle and the lower falls. The upper falls is a very short walk from the visitors car park. The limestone and the shale have eroded over time at different rates causing these three steps. The distance from the upper falls down to the lower falls is actually only half a mile and completely accessible. So if you park in the visitor centre you can actually walk through the car park and down the short footpath and view the upper falls from the bridge. To access the middle and the lower falls you enter Freeholders Wood. That's a, a piece of ancient coppiced woodland. It's home to various mammals including dormice which have been reintroduced. Many wildflowers including wood anemones which carpet the area in the spring and various orchids, some of them quite rare. You can actually view the middle falls from the viewing platform equally spectacular but quite different and then you can walk the half mile down to the lower falls. You can actually get down to the water at that level. Um, lots of interesting things to see on the way. There's also um, a Millennium Project walk with text to follow which you can find on seats um, secreted along the rise of steps um, and on some stone stepping stones which is fun to transport all of the text. So nearby there's the village of West Burton which also has some really beautiful waterfalls which are quite accessible. Um, it's a very picturesque village with a traditional village green, some very interesting businesses including the famous cat pottery. Nearby to Aesgarth Falls is Castle Bolton, which is of historical importance for various reasons. Uh, Mary Queen of Scots was imprisoned there for six months and it was important during the Civil War. And the castle features in the film um, Elizabeth. Currently, it's a very interesting visitor attraction for families. There is a, a maze, wild boar to feed, birds of prey to view. Uh, a wonderful cafe, guided tours, lots of events throughout the year, reenactments of events that happened during the Civil War. So overall, Aesgarth Falls and the area around is a wonderful area to visit for the whole family, come rain or shine.